The mission of the pathology department at Stanford is to help to create the future of the discipline. We'd like to do at Stanford what others would consider cutting edge work in about five or ten years. And our approach to that has been to attempt to recruit the brightest and best people. There's a whole range of researchers ranging from basic science, uh, tenure track professors, to clinical educators. The collaborations really enhance patient care because we can help determine the prognosis uh, which allows the treating physician to uh, select the right treatment for the right patient. The uh, degree of collaboration that occurs between different departments has allowed me to really benefit from uh, recent advances in, in a whole range of technologies that were developed in other departments and by other collaborators and apply them with the goal of uh, really doing translational research. One project at Stanford is an attempt to use artificial intelligence to improve on what pathologists already can do very well in analyzing pathological specimens. Essentially, computer learning is used to identify morphological features in tumor samples that correlate with tumor behavior. CPATH discovered that there were very important uh, morphological prognosticators of disease behavior that resided uniquely in the stroma. And we ultimately hope to develop novel markers that can be used in a routine search path setting for uh, prognosticating disease. Another research project that is very important in the department is to use entire genomes, transcriptomes, metabolomes of individual patients to help both understand the origin of their disease and to define the best sorts of treatment for those diseases. Next generation sequencing allows DNA sequencing to be done for a lower cost and at a higher throughput than was previously available with older technologies. Now we have a vast array of possibilities and that helps us accomplish precision medicine which is accurate individualized patient care and that's important for diagnosis, disease prognosis and subtyping, monitoring and treatment. As these tests continue to grow, it requires us to have even more expertise in the diagnosis of specific diseases and to uh, be the interpreter of those results for the treating physician. The Stanford Molecular Pathology Laboratory has the sole contract for molecular cystic fibrosis newborn screening for all of California. What we do in this laboratory is a panel of 40 different mutations, and for those patients who need it, we can go on to full gene sequencing of the CFDR gene. By having the molecular testing all under one roof, we shorten the turnaround time of our test results so that our patients can be referred and treated as soon as the diagnosis is made. We think that one of the most important things we can do in the department is to help identify and then mentor the next generation of pathologists coming into the field. I think what Stanford excels at is providing an optimal balance between structured clinical training as well as trainee specified research opportunities. We have a strong mentoring program where all trainees have a faculty mentor that meets with them at least twice a year. Over time, most of our trainees acquire more than one mentor so that they can get a, a research mentor, a clinical mentor, uh, and they can really shape the career that's best for them. Our residents have an outstanding track record of obtaining the positions that they seek and also independent research funding. And many of our residents are offered faculty positions right out of training. Regarding the future, I expect that we will continue to contribute uh, not only by training excellent surgical pathologists, but also developing uh, new researchers in the field of translational research. I think the future of the Stanford Pathology Department is bright. If precision medicine is leveraged optimally, it will propel medical knowledge at unprecedented speed and will elevate patient care to an entirely new level. And in our department, we have a strong vision for the future, we have outstanding research, and we have a strong entrepreneurial spirit, which is still firmly rooted in patient care. <laughs>